guys welcome back to my channel and this is first lady and i am in the kitchen as you can see what do you think this is in this skillet that i'm frying well it is jackfruit and i am making jackfruit chicken if you can believe it, this is completely vegan. So I'm just letting it brown. Going to flip it over. In my skillet here, that I have going on high. And, of course, you can find got food at Trader Joe's. I think is where I got this and other um, international food markets. Or well, your grocery store may have it. You never know. But just wanted to try this and I will let these finish cooking. And then when I pull them out, I will show you the finished product. Jack fruit chicken. So if you don't know what jackfruit is, this is what it looks like. I got this at Trader Joe's. It is Trader Joe's green jackfruit in brine. And as you can see, this is like a 10 ounce can, uh, but it is uh, in brine, which makes it a little bit salty. But you can see this is jackfruit. And it only has 35 milligrams of sodium, so not very much, but it has uh, 40 calories per serving. So this is what the jackfruit looks like. And so as it is frying, I'm making a fake out chicken tenders, chicken bites, if you will, with my jackfruit. It's completely vegan. And so as this is cooking, I'm flipping it over in the pan here and I will keep letting them cook until they get done and then I'll come back and show you the finished product be back in a little bit wow as you can see my jackfruit chicken bites already look how nice they look i have a few that are left that need to be pulled out of this grease but this oil that i'm cooking it in but they look amazing don't they and they smell amazing too i mean actually it just smells just like fried chicken in the house so i mean this is something very interesting to do to try to go you know meatless and to incorporate less meat uh, more meatless meals you know into your daily weekly diet so i'm excited about being able to go meatless going vegan i've been inspired by some other videos that i've watched um you know and it, it's supposed to be a healthier lifestyle and uh, we can all use a little more help in our lives, so that's important. Uh, but this is uh, just something that I'm trying, my jackfruit chicken bites. And I'm just finishing them up. I'm going to pull these out, and then I'll show you the finished product. Hi, it is First Lady. I'm back. And all of my jackfruit is done. And I just wanted to show you how good it is. Oh my goodness, I'll just show you a little of it right here. I have taken all of them out of the fryer and now it is time for the taste test. Ooh, let me try it. Oh, it's hot. Mmm. Look at that. That's hot. Mmm. Okay. Look at 
at that. It's almost like the texture of chicken. It really is. And it tastes amazing. Uh, amazing. I'm not even kidding right now. <laughs> mm. I think like if I'm going to eat something that's not meat and it's not chicken, but it's jackfruit, it needs to be this. Mmm. 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 Look at that. Like a chicken tender or a chicken bite. Look how hot it is. <laughs> well, anyway, all I did was I seasoned it and I battered it and I put it in my fryer in my Dutch oven and fried it a few minutes. And I've got these golden brown, delicious jerk, jack, <laughs> jack fruit chicken bites. Mm. I hope you try this recipe. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video, and let me know your comments. If you try uh, the jackfruit uh, recipe for making jackfruit chicken bites, you can dip them in different sauces, you know, barbecue sauce. You can make your own barbecue sauce or like a honey mustard would be great with this. But I hope you try it. I hope you like it. Um, and I hope you leave me a comment and let me know how you enjoyed this recipe. And I hope that you enjoy it as much as I do. And uh, as always, love you guys. Be blessed.